opportunity for the U17 All-Stars is good. That's number... And third world answers back on the other end. That was number 32. Kian Avalis. Isaac Lopez. Ball That's stolen there by third world. But Lopez coming right back with the steal for the U17 All-Star. Near ball there. No resistance. And Clinton were looking for, for that, but his teammates are, are going inside with the higher percentage shot. No defense. Boom! Left wide open. That's not even hand down man now. That's no man um, covering the, the uh, player and he makes them pay. 42 what 26. A spin move inside the paint there by number six, Lindsay Young. But. Traveling violation is called. Spectacular move by Lindsay Young, but just couldn't finish. It's number 30 pushing the ball up the floor. Kwan Avalis. And the third three point shot is no good. Lindsay Young coming up with the defensive rebound. Quick outlet. Euro going glass is Roderick Castillo. There's quick outlet to Castillo. That three-point attempt off the side of the rim. As the All-Star is on the attack. Got a step there as there is a block shot. But the U-17 All-Stars recover. Running floater doesn't go. Tama! No! As the ball was deflected out off a uh, third world player. With 5.05 remaining in the ball game. And it's a 14 points lead for the third world U-17 team. Definitely we're seeing Rashid Renault off the, the bench. Is he getting ready to check in? And I'm looking for him to make immediate impact as he steps in into the ball game. Number if he's 35. indeed coming in. That's Jared Phillips. Clinton with the score. Clinton with the step back jumper. No good. Tyrese uh, Usher coming up with the offensive rebound. And that's the guy that I think have the mm -hmm. great potential when he makes it into the NEB. And I'm not going to say if he makes it in, he will make it into the NEB. What a move from Tyree Susher. <laughs> Definitely that's an acrobatic move there for the finger roll. Extending the lead now to 14 points. Finishing with the left hand. What a move. Number six, Lindsey Young. Lindsay Young taking that ball right into the defense and with the finger roll getting the layup. Clinton for three. No good. As the ball was deflected out off the U17 All-Star there. Not in agreement, but it was the right call. Number three, Greg Fisher. Call in there by Lindsay Young. Lindsay Young goes to court with a tomahawk slam. Is Lindsay Young ready for the NEBL? I <laughs> definitely so. <laughs> wow. A U17 player getting up that high and finishing with an emphatic dunk. Woo! Uh, spine thing live, but unable to corral that, 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 that uh, pass. And we're definitely going to get into this one. Lindsey Young with a pass inside to Rashid Renault. And that's no what good. I love about Lindsey Young. His vision of the court. Finding a wide open Renault who couldn't finish. And these guys are getting ready for the highlight reel. Number three. These guys are missing. No look pass here. Step back jumper. And it's now <laughs> an eight point lead for third world. Not a move. 
splitting the defense reverse layup. I am so impressed with Greg Fisher. Uh -huh. Sorry, that's um, Tyrese, Tyrese Usher. Usher. So impressed with Tyrese. And now I I'm getting to like Lindsay Young also. Yes. He was going with the no look pass, but the ball was stolen there. Woo! The Tomahawk slam. Uh, not even the NBL um, players are abusing the rim. The, the way the, the, these youngsters are, are abusing the rim. No, but these U these U17 <laughs> players, they are getting up high. Uh, and they are playing at the U17 level, and some of them could be well 15 and yes, 16. Yes. Definitely seeing a display of athleticism. Pass break. Not a Tomahawk. A Tomano. Yeah, he got caught uh, on the siding in the air. Whether should I dunk or just lay the ball up? What a pass. Too strong off the glass. That was a steal. U17 All-Stars doesn't get it. It's ball back to third world. 125 remaining in the ballgame. But what we are seeing here in the fourth quarter is some highlights from these young U17 players getting up high. Uh, Lindsay Young with that uh, dunk just a while ago that really, really have me impressed here in the broadcast booth. It's just the actual fundamental. We're seeing a display of athleticism, but we're not seeing seeing a lot of one-on-one -on -one basketball right now. Not, don't see anybody drawing up any players, trying to, trying to run a lot of curls that you were seeing mm. with, with, with Pulo's team earlier. You know, Tyrese right. just showed me what he have going to the to the glass and making good on the layup with his right hand. Now he just finished with his left hand, and so we are seeing the complete player that this kid is. And with Tyrese, I want you to stay focused. You will be, you will be that guy in the any bell, whether it will be with the Hurricanes or with the Defenders or with the Tiger Sharks or with the Belmapan Bandits. You will be in the NEBL. Rashid Renault, brother of Roger Renault, just scoring. And it's becoming a tomahawk show. The guy just backing off on defense and trying to put off put on a show for the fans. That was Jaden Humes with that dunk just a while ago for the third world. Tyrese! Oh, sure. With a miss. And they're just letting the clock run out here now at the Civic Center. And it will be third world winning this one by a score of 54-38. It's a 16-point 16, 16 victory for third world in that U-17 exhibition game. What we'll do, we'll go to a break. And then when we come back, we will have the U-21 championship game for you here from the Civic Center in Belize City. You're watching Amadea Basketball League on TNC. We will be right back.